evacuation approved for the flight today. If you happen to be in possession of one of these types of masks, please do alert a flight attendant. Uh, just a few minutes. Flight time today, one hour and 53 minutes. Mask will drop from above your seat and from the restroom ceiling. If the strap appears and you cannot reach the mask, pull down on the strap to access your mask. From withhold a mask to extend the plastic tubing and start the flow of oxygen. Place the mask over your nose and mouth. Put the elastic band over your head and tighten the straps as necessary. Oxygen is flowing even if the bag does not inflate. Put on your mask before helping others. And as a reminder, in the event that we do experience a decompression on board the aircraft today, remember to remove your face covering prior to applying those oxygen masks. And should you need it, you will find a light vest with a water-activated light in a pouch under or between your seat. We'll when directed, pull the tab to retrieve the pouch. If there is a strap, remove it from around the pouch. Tear the pouch open, remove it, and fold the vest. Flip it over your head, wrap the belt around your waist, and secure it to the buckle and front by pulling on the loose end to tighten. And just before leaving the aircraft, inflate that vest by pulling down sharply on the red tab or by blowing into the tube. This aircraft also has instant light vests, which will be distributed only if necessary. Smoking and using e-cigarettes or smoking tobacco are not allowed on this aircraft. Federal law does prohibit tampering with, disabling, or destroying any laboratory smoke detectors. U.S. law requires passengers to comply with all light assigns, packers, and especially crew member instructions. And we'll be taking off soon, so once again at this time, please ensure that your seat backs are in their full upright position, that your tray tables are put away, that your seat belts are securely fastened, and that your headrests are in the down and fully stowed position. If you are seated in our first class cabin today, we'll be collecting all of your pre-departure beverage items for takeoff at this time as well. And if you have placed any items underneath those seats in front of you, please ensure that they are placed completely and fully forward and that nothing is obstructing that area around your feet in any capacity. And once again, if you are seated in any of our window emergency exit rows today, please ensure that all electronic devices are unplugged in the outlets for takeoff at this time. And if you ha do happen to be seated in a window seat today, we do ask that you raise those window shades for takeoff as well. We'll be giving the cabin lighting for the duration of today's flight. If you do intend to sleep on this flight, please ensure that your belt buckle is fastened, your seatbelt is fastened over your outermost blanket or over the top of your clothing, so that this way we will see it throughout the flight. We will not need to disturb you whenever we're conducting those seatbelt checks. And if you happen to utilize those sanitizer wipes that we handed out to you during boarding and you would like to dispose of those, please hand those over to the aisleways momentarily as we come through so that we may collect these items on our way as well. And once again, thank you for flying with us. I'll be back with more details about today's flight once you're in the air. And once again, welcome on board.
for departure.
Denver, Colorado. The local time here is 3.46 p.m. We are now in Mountain Time and will be taxiing for a few more minutes, so we do ask that you remain seated with your seatbelt securely fastened and all of your carrying items stowed until the captain has turned off that seatbelt sign. That will be your one and only indication that it's safe to get up and move about the cabin. Once again, please stay comfortably seated until that seatbelt sign is turned off. You may continue to use and charge your phones and tablets. However, if you are seated in that exit row today, we do ask that you refrain from plugging any of your devices into the outlets at this time. And if you are connecting here today to any other United, United Express, or Star Alliance flights, we ask that you check those departure monitors located throughout the terminal as well as the United app for the most up-to-date information and do proceed directly to your gates for boarding. As a reminder, if you're utilizing the departure screens in the terminal, please ensure you are in fact looking at the departure screen and not the arrival screen. And once again, don't forget to check around your seat back pockets, the areas around your seat. Make sure that you do have all of your personal belongings and please use caution when retrieving articles from those overhead compartments as contents do tend to ship during the flight. And if you're home, we'd like to be the first to welcome you home for those of you who are visiting or continuing on. We wish you a very safe journey on behalf of United as well as the Star Alliance and also your Denver and Boston based in-flight crew. We've enjoyed having you with us today. It's been our sincerest pleasure to serve you and we look forward to seeing you again on a future United flight. Thank you and have a wonderful day.